Hello friends, in this video I am going to explain you how to install Google Play Store on emulator. You would have observed that some emulators are missing Google Play Store app installed in them. For example, I have created Pixel 6 virtual device with API level 31. In this emulator I could not find Play Store app. But if I run this uh, Pixel device with API 28, I can see the Play Store app. So what is the difference why some emulators are not having Google Play Store app installed and how to install the Play Store app on emulator? I am going to explain in this video. The first solution for this issue is selecting the proper device definition while creating the virtual device. In the device manager while creating the virtual device, you can see the Play Store column with the Play Store icons. So if you select any one of these devices with the icon, you can have Google Play Store app on your emulator. See here you can find the system images targeting Google Play. So you can select currently installed system images for specific API level or you can install new images for other Android API level also based on your requirement and select them while creating the virtual device. But if you select a device without Play Store icon, you can see the list of system images targeting only Google APIs. So while creating the device itself, select the proper device definition to have the Google Play Store app installed on your emulator. But how to install the Play Store app on the emulator that is the virtual device already created without the Play Store icon? For this, you need to update config files. Let's see how to do this. First go to settings icon on top right corner, select SDK manager, here select the checkbox show package details. Now come down to the API level for which you wanted to have Play Store app. I wanted it for my Pixel 6 API 31, so scrolling down to 31, here select the system image with Google Play mentioned. Let me select the first one, click apply. Click OK here. It started downloading the system image for API level 31. OK done. Click on apply and OK. Now close the device and kill the process because we are going to change the config files for this device. OK now click on this three dots icon and select show on disk option. It opens the folder for the device. If you don't find the option show on disk then you can go to this path. Users, your system name, dot android, avd and the device dot avd folder. Ok, so these two files config.ini and hardware-qemu.ini we are going to update now. First let us open config.ini, select open with text edit. In this file we need to change these two properties playstore.enabled and image.system directory. Here it is pointing to Google APIs images, we need to update this to point to Google Play Store path. So to find out the exact path, go to home, select library folder. If you do not find one here, then right click select show view options. Select this checkbox show library folder, ok. Open library, android, sdk, system images and select the api level 31. For this api only we downloaded system images with google play store. See here it has both google apis and google apis play store. Others have only Google APIs Play Store installed. So now we need to update this Google underscore APIs path with the Google underscore APIs underscore Play Store path. Now come back, open config file, change this Play Store dot enabled equal to true. Come down, change the path to point to Google APIs Play Store. Copy this. Now open hardware.ini file, come down, change the paths wherever they are pointing to google underscore apis with google underscore apis underscore play store. Okay, here 
and here and here also done. Now change this play store dot enable flag to true. Save and close this INI file. Now come back to Android Studio. Select the wipe data once for Pixel 6 API 31 device. Now start the virtual device. Yes, see the Play Store is installed on the simulator. Now you can use this without any issues. Hope this video helped you to install the Play Store on your emulator. If yes, please comment, like the video and subscribe to iRecatech Solutions. Thank you.